So we are, I'd say, at the 95% stage of being done. 5% um, left. 5% left here. Yes, the three-month process is almost at an end. Today we're making a beer dye table. I'm having Jake help me. He's done before and he has some schematics he's gonna show us. And we're gonna get that going. Right. What's up guys? We're building a dye table. Let's get it. <laughs> All right, so we got our schematic here. You always wanna draw it out real nice before you do it. We're gonna go by a uh, eight by four foot table here. That's gonna be three feet in height. But we're gonna be going with uh, four planks, a two by four. We're gonna cut one three foot and eight inches. We're gonna cut the other one at eight feet. And then we're going to get four 4x4 four four, uh, posts that are going to be three feet in uh, length. You've got to get the tabletop, that plywood, probably going to get a little bit of a thicker plywood with that. And that's going to be cut 8x4 exactly. Nah. <laughs> <laughs> then we basically just need a box of screws and a drill. And that, that, that basically does it. Let's go get the drill. What's up, everybody? What's up, everybody? Yes, you are damn right. Jake gets his very own side adventure. We are getting the drill. Logan is gonna go get a tabletop. I am getting the drill. I also am gonna get the projector. Got drill and a projector. Let's get it. So, <laughs> two tall, longest pieces, eight feet long there. Those are gonna be the sides of the table. Four big posts here, four legs there, three feet in length, so the table will be three feet high. These are the other side panels, and then two underlying support beams. We'll see how that turns out. So this is the design we got here of the table, and then a list down here. Details how it's gonna be put together. So let's get cracking. Take a break and uh, take a short break, and then what we're going to be doing is. Hey, should I end this? That's the winner. We are back. We're gonna go ahead and sand this guy down a little bit. The outside is gonna be black. Now we're on to the actual artistic part of the project now. My mom helped out with the final design and we had the chapel with the skull, House of Jericho, and it's gonna be laid out exactly like that. The eight feet here, the four feet here on the table. And we're gonna get projecting, we're gonna get taping, and then painting. One, two, three. Break. <laughs> oh, hello. So, here you can see we have our little setup here. Um, this is the tabletop, actually. We brought it inside and set a projector with the design onto the table. And now it's just a matter of tracing. We're using pencils. This is how it turns out. We're done. That we are. We're just taping it up right now. This is going to allow us just to paint over the letters. We kind of gave up putting the tape on. It was taking way too long. So we decided to use a fine paintbrush and then we can just touch up. Hopefully it'll be fine.
Is everything else enough? No, I'm so joking. Careful when you do this, because uh, I guess it's just on there too. What you want to do is take a little bit more white paint and just real small paintbrush, just tidy up those lines a little bit here and there. We're on the final stage here. The tape did us dirty a little bit. If you can see this, paint has bled a little bit outside the lines. So we're gonna go ahead and do some touch up work. And then we're gonna put a polyurethane coat on the top. Then we're gonna put a line right here. We're gonna have an official ruling when we're playing beard out with the dye and all that. Yeah. So, so, that's so, so, something got, funny. What say, man? I think that the coolest thing about the beard dye rule is this video of Andy Reid as a 13 year old. Oh, oh my gosh. Stop it. Please. Andy Reid is a 13 year old. Jake, what are we doing now? <coughs> what does it look like we're doing now? That's All right. <laughs> <laughs> We got uh, Nick helping us now. Nick, do you have anything to say? Let's, Good. Let's throw some cubes. <laughs> We got one step left. Clear coat, baby. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> It's gonna look nice and clear. White will shine, black will pop. We'll be chilling. The table is not as clear, not as white as we thought it was gonna be. It's all the clear right there, but we didn't notice the satin. The table looks alright. I kind of give it like a treasure mappy, uh, you know, look and feel. It works. It works. All right. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs>